Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Live. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video guys to any of you having a Hyundai Sonata guys. I'm talking about generation 2009 to year 2015. If your master window switch does not work guys and you want to know which fuses control that, you may have up to four fuses. Stay with us, we will explain guys each one of those things now. And one of them is very hidden so make sure to stay until the end. If you guys need to buy any parts, tools, anything like that, check out the link in the description of the video below so you can see where we get all the tools and parts from. Another thing guys, every single car we get at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos. Specifically on this Hyundai Sonata we will have at least 200 free guys electrical videos and at least 300 mechanical videos. Now you can expect to have the electrical videos on that Sonata on this channel. Ok electrical car repair life. But the uh, mechanical videos will be on our main channel Auto Repair guys check it out we have helped more than 100 million people guys we have information that can save you so much money so check it out now with that being said guys okay let's go ahead and start explaining where we have all the fuses for the windows now right here this is your fuse box okay and let's explain okay what we need to do you have one tap here press in you have one tap on this side press this one squish and pull up so that's what we need to do now okay perfect right here you can see we have a fuse puller so grab it squish pull it out we're going to go on the inside and i'll show you where all the fuses are located now okay for that master window switch okay right here i'm talking about so if you come right here guys okay next to the steering wheel you have another fuse box that we'll be working on okay and this fuse box okay what you need to do pull down okay like that now there are multiple fuses that we need to check here and then there is one that's actually not here and we need to talk about that one where exactly okay it's located so you may actually i said four but you may have up to five fuses guys for that specific master window switch coming this way okay let's explain now okay what we have specifically so coming guys okay on the on the left row now this is the left row we need to come to the forward fuse on the left row i'm talking about fuse one two three four this fuse right here 25 amp fuse this is the safety power window switch okay model fuse then you have another fuse right here 20 amp fuse check this one as well then you have one more right here for the left window switch as well it controls the rear left and the master window switch and after that okay you need to come to this side and you need to check the 11th fuse which is one two three four fifth fuse from top to bottom okay row second row from left to right if you guys need to check a fuse pretty simple grab it with the fuse puller pull it out okay this is okay your fuse right here perfect that's what it looks like now how you know if a fuse is burned we have a special video that explains how to test them most of the times you can see if it's burned you can see if the element is broken inside or it looks like it's burned uh, now sometimes it's hard to tell so i recommend to always test them we'll put a link how to test fuse guys uh, super short video but very helpful in the description of the video below so please okay please check it out we're going to explain all that so where is another fuse okay that controls the master window switch okay let me install this one and we're going to go towards uh, the front under the hood and i will explain okay where you can actually expect to have the other one because you have one more fuse controlling that master window switch so you come right here okay and that uh, huge fuse okay that big fuse right here uh, that's actually a fuse guys that we need to check so if you look at it okay from right to left facing this way it's the second fuse inside it's a 60 m fuse you can see it here on the glass 60 m fuse and make sure that the element is good you can actually see that if for some reason you cannot see how you can test that fuse we'll have a video but you need to disconnect the car battery now on these modern vehicles it really matters which terminal you disconnect and reconnect first because if you do it the wrong way what can happen actually guys you can kill your engine computer electronics modules we did that something like that and it cost us two thousand dollars so we have a video that explains how to actually properly connect and disconnect the battery i'll put the link in the description of the video below once you do that remove that nut then you have one tooth holding that fuse here in place 
remove it and pull it out and then you can test with voltmeter here and on the fuse itself okay make sure you have a continuous connection if not the fuse is burning guys the second fuse from right to left so hopefully the video will be helpful to any of you having uh, that problem with master window switch not working thank you for watching and see you guys next time